Hi! So today we're going to be launching an American satellite on a booster built by Israel. Just kidding, it was built by America. <laughs> uh, I built it myself and I sent it over to the Israel Space Agency and they really appreciated it. So yeah, uh, I really hope this booster uh, gives you guys or, you know, uh, makes you guys save more money, I guess. So yeah, although I watched the first launch and it failed, which kind of disappointed me. I was like, but I made sure I tested this booster like five times. And there goes the separation of the first stage. Very Falcon 9-esque. And I'm going to land on a drone ship because that's only something skilled players like me can do because I'm a pro at this game. Actually, no, I had unbreakable parts and no heat damage turned on, so yeah. Anyway, there goes the fairing and reach space. So yeah, that's cool. And switching over to the stage to flip for the entry burn. Also, one thing I need to mention about this booster is that the uh, entry burn, you have to perform it really, really late. No, please don't do that. <laughs> I mean, you have to perform it really, really early or else your booster will crash into the ground and potentially destroy your drone ship. So yeah, that's a little um, tip. If you somehow get your hands on this rocket, yeah, um, which I'm probably not going to put it in the description because it's only exclusive to Israel. So, yeah. There we go. <laughs> the, the landing is, or has initiated. And again, landing on a drone ship because that's only something pros do. Like me. <laughs> okay, just kidding. I'm not a pro with this game. So, yeah, you can see the drone ship right there. It's the same one as in the Falcon 9 video. And again, as I mentioned, I have unbreakable parts and infinite fuel. Not infinite fuel. Uh, no heat damage turned on and touchdown. So don't try landing that hard again. Same thing I said in the Canadian video. So, yeah, the booster recovered and now to make it into orbit. Let's just time warp a little and fire. There we go. We reached orbit. And now here comes the deployment of the satellite. And yeah, that's about it. <laughs> Switching to the second stage to deorbit it because this is also recoverable, not just the first stage booster because, you know, uh, I'm guessing the Israel Space Agency doesn't have that big of a budget, so yeah. They only have a, one space station and one Mars base, I think. Which, uh, funnily enough, uh, this rocket is launching um, a US satellite. And in the lore of the ISA uh, world, I guess you would call it, the US and Israel don't have such a you know great relationship because apparently the u.s invaded their base on mars and israel has been seeking revenge <laughs> so i don't even know why i made this rocket i just wanted to be nice so yeah you're welcome there go the parachutes also i kind of messed up in the re-entry but hey i had no heat damage on so yeah the sfs community accepts cheats right I mean, th this uh, this technically isn't cheating because you need this for the rocket to work. So, yeah, just, you know, view it that way, I guess. And deploying the solar panels and the antenna to start spying, I, I mean, uh, reconnaissance of the oceans to... Uh, To, to see the clouds and the hurricanes to warn uh, nations to... Yeah, I, I, I definitely wasn't saying something else there. Don't worry, Israel, you're safe. Anyway, uh, moving on. Uh, the satellite is now climbing to its operational orbit of 200 kilometers above the Earth's surface. So, yeah, that's cool. And... Yeah, right there, climbing to its operational orbit as i said anyway the video is about to end so if you want me to show off like one of your blueprints in 
a future video, uh, then leave it down in the comments. But please use Google Drive because I don't want a virus with Mediafire. So, yeah, uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a like if you want. And, yeah, all my socials are in the description. And don't worry, that's, that's the name. It's uh, nothing bad, I promise. And, yeah, bye.